Hey guys, happy Monday. Um, I hope you're having a really great day. Here it's um, once again gross and snowy outside and whatever. Um, but yeah, I have a little like tiny mini story time uh, to tell you because I don't know, this just freaked me out. Um, and like something like this has never happened to me before. Um, so just a quick, like, just so you know what's going on. Um, I, the house that I live in, um, it actually, like, it's owned by my parents. It used to belong to my grandmother. Um, and my brother used to live there. And so his old vehicle that doesn't run is, um, sitting, there's like a little, side part of the driveway that it's sitting in and um it's it's just sitting there like it doesn't I don't know that it runs um but anyway so um I was at home and it was 10 o'clock okay so it's 10 o'clock at night I was in my pajamas which consisted of a little tank top um no bra and a pair of shorts right like I'm by myself at home just gonna go to bed and um, I was watching one of the new documentaries on Netflix and I, I can't, was it Born Strong? I think that might be what it's called, but I'm not 100% sure, but it's got um, like Eddie Hall and um, you know, a couple of other guys in it. Um, whatever, not that you guys really care, but yeah. So I'm sitting there watching this movie, it's 10 o'clock and all of a sudden there is just like a bang, bang, bang on my door like somebody's pounding on my door and I thought for a minute that it might have been my parents like maybe they were gonna go next door where my aunt and uncle live and um, like play cards or something and maybe they were just playing a joke on me so I was like god you don't have to like pound on the door so I get up I turn on the porch light and I open the door and it's this guy I have never seen in my life I don't I don't know who this guy is and he had um, I think a cigarette, like not a lit cigarette, but he was either like a cigarette or like a pen, like hanging out of his mouth. The door was kind of like frosted over, so it was hard to tell. Um, but anyway, so I'm looking at him through my storm door, like what is up with this? Like, and he says, <clears throat> hi, you guys want to get rid of that blazer out there? You going to sell it? And I said, I don't think this is the appropriate time of evening to be talking about selling a van. He interrupted me to say, I can't hear you. And I said, it's 10 o'clock. And I slammed the door. And then without thinking, I turned the porch light off and walked away and like got back on my couch and covered up with my blankets. So he actually had to go out to his car like in the dark, but 10 o'clock at night, this random stranger knocks on my door wanting to know about possibly buying a vehicle that's in my driveway. I mean, am, am I like overreacting about this or is it a little bit inappropriate? Because to me, I just feel like that's really inappropriate. Um, I don't know, maybe it's not, but well, I don't know, what do you think? So tell me in the comments what you think, if I overreacted or if it is pretty ridiculous to just show up at somebody's house at 10 o'clock at night when you don't know them. Um, and if you like this little story time video, make sure to give me a little thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you can be notified when I upload because it's kind of whenever I feel like it. <laughs> um, yeah, that's it. I just got home. I'm going to go in and eat some lunch. Um, so make sure to check the description box because I will have links to my, uh, Snapchat, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, God only knows what else. And also to my little Teespring shop, which has tons of super cute uh, workout tanks. There are also t-shirts, long sleeve shirts, sweatshirts, uh, canvas totes, stickers, and coffee mugs. <clears throat> so check that out. Buy something. Help out a cool person like, you know, me. And uh, that's all I have for today. So I will see you guys next time. Hopefully soon. <laughs> Have a great Monday and enjoy the rest of your week. Bye.